That is some sound effect of applause and whistles. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, engineers. Hey, all you cool cats and kittens. Tom Hanks hosts a special at-home edition of Saturday Night Live. And live from Zoom, it's sometime between March and August. Yeah. Oh. SNL returned from a month-long coronavirus hiatus, featured the cast members sending in their sketches from home, and a remote performance from musical guest Chris Martin. Hanks recently contracted COVID-19, along with wife Rita Wilson, while shooting a film in Australia. The actor called himself the celebrity canary in the coal mine for coronavirus as he gave the SNL monologue from his kitchen. But why me as host? Well, for one, I have been the celebrity canary in the coal mine for the coronavirus. And ever since being diagnosed, I have been more like America's dad than ever before, since no one wants to be around me very long and I make people uncomfortable. Hanks explained that the cast was all working remotely and the show wasn't going to be live as it usually airs. Also, there's no such thing as Saturdays anymore. It's just every day is today. And we're not really live, but we are doing everything we can to make this feel like the SNL you know and love. I am even using cue cards, see? I am even using cue cards. Just riff, baby, that's what I'm doing. The first traditional sketch featured Kate McKinnon as Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg in RBG's Workout Corner. I'm very tough. I'm 87 years old. I survived cancer four times. I went to law school during the Spanish flu. Beat it. Guest stars included Larry David as Bernie Sanders, and Alec Baldwin reprised his Donald Trump impression and called into Weekend Update. What exactly is your advice? Because it seems to change every 24 hours. That's a nasty question. You're very nasty. Consistent. <laughs> <laughs> All along. I've always said it was a giant hoax that we should take very seriously, even though it was invented by the Democrats. Impeach me, part two. So everyone needs to wash their hands or not. <laughs> <laughs> Weekend Update host Michael Che addressed the loss of his grandmother, who died of complications from the coronavirus the week prior. Hey, guys, by the way, uh, this was really fun. And as you know, Colin, I, I lost my grandmother this week. And uh, coming back to work uh, really made me feel better, especially with you. The show also paid tribute to late SNL music producer Hal Wilner, who passed away due to the complications from the coronavirus. Cast members, past and present, including Adam Sandler and Fred Armisen, shared their memories of Wilner, who has worked with SNL since 1980. Okay.